Hey, what's up, y'all? Subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, watch the recent videos, share my channel also. Just doing my weekly update of my cash out portfolio, man. Um, you know, it's done been down for the last couple of days, last three days. Still holding good, man. The account's still above $56,000. Got $56,033. <clears throat> it's my um my account portfolio. Um today I'm down $108 today, 0.19%. I can see overall, I got $50,061.19 uh, invested. I'm up $5,973.33. That's not counting all the dividends I done made um, for the last four years. So the fifty nine seventy three plus all the dividends I done got. So looking kind of good. Uh, cash balance looking good. You know, your dividends go automatically to your cash balance. My, my stuff is not on, it's not on drip. But um, biggest winners, as I always do, do my top ten uh, AT and T. As you can see, up eight hundred fifty-two bucks. Uh, in the beta of industrial properties, six hundred forty-five dollars fifty-three cent. Three M, up four hundred fifty-two dollars seventy-three cent. Citigroup up three seventy. Uh, Realty O up three hundred sixty three dollars. U S Bank up three hundred forty six. IBM up two seventy nine. Uh, AGNC, I'm up 269 bucks. Truist Financial, 267 bucks. Altria, up 251 bucks. And New York Community Bank, up $263. <clears throat> A slow scroll to all of my other holdings. You can check out. You can pause this video anywhere you want. Um... I'm gonna get down to my losers. Discover Financial. I'm up 38 bucks. Um, just really like my buy and hold portfolio here. I don't sell anything unless I sell to get out. I just sold my uh Starbucks position. To get out of that. They got bad things going on. Nothing wrong with it. Part of the game, but I'm getting out of that fast food stuff. Them and Mc and, and McDonald's just had some bad news. Uh. <clears throat> with start with start with Starbucks, they need you know they got the new CEO from Chip Chip Pot Chip Potley. Like he said, they uh their their management just uh overall it needs a a whole it needs a new overhaul. It says um and I did a video a while back saying it's gonna take at least a year for them to get some things in order in order. So they need a new process with their business. Um, and Mc, Mc, McDonald's just had that Coley uh out the out, outbreak in their quarter quarter pound of burgers, and they they stock is down significant today. I think another seven percent added on to seven percent it was on yesterday. And I know once this money really get tight, fast food people not gonna have not gonna have money to go out and eat. That's all of my fast food stuff I do sell. I'm putting into Walmart. <clears throat> um, so um, so people gonna go gro go grocery shopping. The other one you might want to do is Kroger's. Um, but let me take you to my last six. My with my last ten. I'm sorry. What you see, I'm gonna start from the bottom. Is big is big lots. They done closed a lot of store, stores up, so hopefully they might turn around. Another one, <clears throat> the CVS, um, down two hundred thirty one bucks. Armor Residential REIT down two hundred five dollars and eighty cent. But I done got four years worth 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 of dividends, so I'm up in that. Nike, I'm down. Need to buy more of that. Intel, I'm down. That's gonna turn around for the future. Dollar General. I mean, the market pulling back anyway. Um, Orion Office REITs, I got dividends, so it might not down as much as it says. UPS down $49. Western Union down 43 Hawaiian Electric 34 And D Audio down 1435 So not bad. These are dividend paying stocks. Uh, I call these dividend growth, growth stocks. Most of my positions uh, in this portfolio. So that's what it is, man. Y'all enjoy your day. Go get your money.